It's now time for Mission, and Mission is sponsored by Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid, and the EU. Let's go to the Bono region where parents of Kofi Swa in the Doma Central Municipality have devised means to solve their school's infrastructure challenge in the face of slow response to their plights. Stanley Nibleu has more. Government introduced education in Kofi Swa in the early 90s after a pavilion was provided to shelter pupils. Since then, government has not provided infrastructure again. The growing population of the school compelled parents to improvise. Through communal labor and monthly contributions, they have been able to provide the school with a befitting office, classroom blocks for the primary pupils and the kindergarten. They have also converted the old pavilion into a complete classroom block which now accommodates junior high pupils while another has been built to serve as library. Parents are happy they are impacting lives. Former assemblyman for the area, Stephen Kwame Asante Krobia, is part of the mobilization team for the development. <laughs> The kindergarten structure is not spacious enough and so the school authorities have converted the library into classroom and now accommodated by KG pupils. The enrollment have been increased and sustained by the school feeding program. Head teacher of the school, Andrew Skufiatha, said provision of teaching and learning materials has been a concern. He's worried about the constant exploitation of pupils by parents. Because this community is a farming community, most of the parents do not uh, encourage their children, especially with this trend of education, to come to school. And there are some, because of financial constraint, they take their children to come and then help them to do farming work. And as that's for Mission, Mission is sponsored by Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the EU. Thanks so much for watching.